everyone welcome to my blog 48 for recipe you can check my description box for your reference before packing stuff Miles created a checklist for what she need and don't need and she got rid of most of the stuff she didn't need uh, like clothes and kitchen items and her studio things one day uh, before moving Malvika's team and friends packed studio items and labeling each and every boxes and and professional packers they also came came and packed items and uh, we labeled them with names like room one room two room three hall kitchen bathroom and I packed my own box like an uh, imported item like dishes, spices, grinder, pans, spoons and tea powder and vegetable, dal and breakfast items for emergency, you know, to cook. And a grinder, glassware, crockeries, um, also do pictures and all that. This helped us to keep uh, track of the boxes also easy to identify immediately after the move, you know, and to avoid any confusion when unpacking. See, middle of this mess, see, I'm making chai. I kept a separate box here. And uh, I'm going to make uh, coconut chutney and dosa. I'm also taking uh, this lemongrass I wash and clean for the new house. And there I don't know the local market, so I would better carry. I'm carrying coconut also, some spoons in one box, so I don't have to open the box and search for the spoons and uh, for the dosa and uh, to fry things and all. They pack so professionally and uh, each and every glasses they wrapped and they're going to unwrap also um, once they move these boxes. That helped a lot. You know. They wrapped and kept everything ready. So tomorrow morning they're going to shift the whole boxes to new location. I'm going to clean the fridge and I'm going to get, uh, get rid of a few stuffs and uh, um, like dairy product and the perishable item, veggies and all I'm going to take to my boy's place. And uh, so we have a clean fridge when we move to new house. So it's very easy for me to store once again. I'm going to take a break and have lunch. Ordered Mac. Seventy-five percent already finished packing, and this uh, professional packers and my son and his team will ship the things to new house. Me and Malvik on our way to Andheri West, to boys' place. As soon as I landed to Andheri West, I went to the store and bought some stuff like hari sabzi and vegetables and um, fruits and grocery item because at boys' place I don't know what is there, what is not there. Because I don't live with my boys now, I'm staying with Malvika, she needs my help. So I carried the stuff that I wanted. So at boys place I'm making uh, khichdi, this is the masala I'm going to grind. Here are rice and dal and soaked and kept with uh, asapatita and haldi and namak. And uh, see, um, we, nobody like food from outside you see. So this is the best thing to make khichdi and uh, it's not good for Malvik also eating food from outside all the time. While shifting this is the easiest dish we can cook like khichdi and uh, curd rice like rasam and all that. Uh, you know South Indian dish is very easy to make so with this hot khichdi I'm going to add a little butter and serve with pickle. This Chloe, I'm wondering what's happening here. How come Mama and Malvika is here? How come Malvika is sleeping here? <laughs> what happened? Come, sweetie, come. Come, sweetie. Sweetie, sleeping. Malvika is not living here, but still she's so attached to Malvika, you know. Hey, I like this so much. Hmm? Ah, le, 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 le. Today I'm so excited, all my kids are here, so I'm making poha, I'm making omelette and I'm also making dosa, chutney, all buffet. <laughs> this poha really fills the stomach with bananas and everything, delicious. Look at this, I'm looking for her, always she sits next to me. Look at the shele, 
she loves malvika so much today is we moving all the boxes so me and malvika we going to stay at home and my son and uh, they team and on they going to help in shifting and all that to new house look at my another baby <laughs> for lunch i'm making tomato curry or you can say rasam they all like kar- dai kadi rasam and uh, dal the south indian style along with that i'm making beans and potato bhaji i normally steam uh, beans and uh, potato and stir fry them with tadka i sprinkle little salt while steaming and i i stir fry them in tadka like green chili kadhi patta garlic and order sesame seed mustard seed and cumin seed and pinch of uh, haldi uh, turmeric powder uh, this beautifully steamed as a potato nice and tender now i'm going to stir fry this i'm going to heat oil in a white kadai and i'm going to add mustard seed and all the items like cumin and urad sesame seeds I'm going to stir fry for a second then i'm going to add green chili kadhi patta garlic and uh, just for a second you have to stir fry now i'm going to go ahead and add the steamed item like beans and potato and sprinkle a little salt to taste and haldi and i'm going to add the gun powder also that is optional otherwise we can just haldi will do just stir fry for for a 2 3 minutes this part is almost done see but i'm going to add uh, this gun powder like i said you get this in all the stores This is actually idli gunpowder you use for idli but I when I make sabzi like this stir fry I add them it gives pinch of sugar to balance the taste this sabzi is ready the amazing with curry and uh, rasam I'm sitting here chatting with you guys because in the hall too much noise Malvika is editing and Jake also doing his work and they're talking so I'll keep you posted um if you like that kichdi uh, recipe so just let me know in the comments section uh, after i go there i'll show you all this quick uh, kichdi and sabzis and curries and all after i go to malvika's place okay this is the rasam i'm going to serve with white rice and curd This goes well with rasam and beans bhaji and salad. Look at that dish! It's an amazing. <laughs> this is my plate. I always eat like this. Normally, I eat lot of sabzis, but uh, today I'm hungry. This rasam, my elder son's favorite dish. Always he say, "Mummy make holy rasam. Mummy make tomato rasam." <laughs> chili today who want chili chili today who want chili today ha huh? you gonna miss mama you gonna miss why your ears like this so na 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 i was gonna miss today oi na 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 i always play with them you know i'm the only one who's playing <laughs> ow 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 who wants to go to park Hello, you want to go to park? Who wants to eat chicken? You want to eat chicken? Yeah. Want to eat chicken, Mama? Or you want to go to park in the rickshaw? One big ride, okay? I'm massaging, you know. Chloe, jealous, Kuti. Jungly. And then don't bite me. Oh, It hurts. So sweet. <laughs> <laughs> If I cry, okay, Rob. It's okay. You can cry. <laughs> Monkey. No, she's not biting. <laughs> We shopped at West Side. Uh, she wanted some
plants and pots and other kitchen items and uh, yeah we i bought from f- nice flowers i love flowers i'm going to arrange this flowers look at this so pretty i selected all white looks so nice so because malvika house is all beige that's why i bought men t-shirt extra large no not extra large large to wear at home i always buy big size t-shirts so so nice colors they have yeah he's packing our stuff in one box see it looks so real na these plants see how beautiful this looks kun wala side alag hi maza hai see look at this fruit wala all the labels are hanging this juice that juice beetroot juice malvika is having coconut water i'm i'm, I'm at the supermarket you know me na having malai yeah finally someone who removed it nicely evening i made pancake with the fruits like green apple banana blueberries and uh, nutella delicious we are going back to new house and me and malvika and these packers are unbo- unboxed a uh, few stuff like glasses and crockery and they fix the bed and and cupboard and everything see the kitchen oh my god what a mess the help coming he's going to help me in cleaning all the stuff and wash the dishes and uh, most of the stuff are done so tired so oh freaking tired now mal studio left that tomorrow yeah. so not bad for one day's work for one day's work not bad i shot before so, so look at that and the kitchen na 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 thank <laughs> god mom the most happy is for kitchen only yeah see now to now have to fill all the spices and grains and everything open the fridge and stuff which i bought things hara sabzi no just for temporary i just put by shit we're going to pray give thanks to the lord and go to sleep for tomorrow good morning no matter how tired i am i never stop praising the lord and thanking god for the day good morning um yesterday till 2 o'clock we were doing everything like cleaning and especially the kitchen still to do to take maybe one week to adjust to this kitchen and to keep all the things in place um yeah i had a guy who helped me with this cleaning and all that not alone and uh, let's see how it goes today first day at new house making chai my signature chai <laughs> You must have got bored, no? Looking at my chai. In today, I'm going to make aloo bhaji, and we're going to order ID from outside because I'm not going to make any dosa till we get uh, good help, nice help in the kitchen. I'm so blessed to have such a wonderful and loving, caring kids. They really do care for me. Never say no for anything. That's why I like to do so much for them. Love is like just give and take, and not just take, take or give, give. You know. And uh, even my daughter, she does so much for me, and even the boys. I'm blessed in that way. You know. <laughs> That's why I like to do so much for them because they do so much for me too. You know. I fin already finished cutting aloo and bhaji and I'm going to make now today's aloo bhaji and masala dosa or puri bhaji maybe if we have puri bhaji now then in the evening we'll have masala dosa <laughs> very difficult to find well uh you know a uh, help just to cook and take care of the house till the, till then I will manage the house what to do <laughs> so many ladies they were here they say ha huh, to alas hum kaam kar sakte but khana nahi bana sakte khana kaun banayega me <laughs> there is bartan alag khana wala alag do to take the care of the house alag and chadu kadka alag oh my god then we have to appoint one doorman also to open the door so many people we don't want so many people we want somebody who can take care of the house dusting and to to cut the few things and um basic thing to cook you know that also they don't know oh my god 
this is wheat flour i'm adding salt and ice cold water i'm making a stiff dough uh, when you make this stiff dough and when you roll to a small disc um, not too thin not too thick and when you deep frying uh, in hot oil that the puri will not absorb uh, too much oil i will show you see um, i've already prepared and kept now i'm going to deep fry them look at that how it puffed beautifully sometime i make this uh, flour maida uh, puri also same way same method with the cold water and it comes out like this with the red aloo sabzi tastes amazing see i fried and kept see look at this no oil so dry so here there's aloo dosa batter we'll eat dosa also <laughs> we'll eat puri also <laughs> Well, Jain Kitchen. There's a varieties of food. Now there is chai, my signature chai. See, I'm making masala dosa. Yum yum. Throwing the rubbish, they're so strict. There's a green bin, blue bin, yellow bin, and red bin, and you can't make mistake. Otherwise, they'll find. <laughs> So every day when I'm throwing stuff, I have to check the list where to put what. <laughs> like that. See, so systematic. See, and the housekeeping guys they come and collect all the kachras. If a little mistake, finish. You're fined. Teaching me how to order from Zepto. She ordered uh, Zepto. You know, I'm so used to going to the supermarket, pick my own fruits and vegetables and groceries. she said mom you can't do it it's very difficult you have to order from place because we don't have a, a supermarket like we have in andheri west uh, this side uh, bandra side is little difficult so yet i went to the market i, I will show you next if i make a next uh, vlog i might show you i went to a local market here also to, to check where is a fish market where is a local market we will get vegetables and the stores and everything but um, west side and the west side more convenient <laughs> but here we have to order like this we got it all no ma'am go to the local mala society store no no need to go oh, it's all here oh, something also wow. we are blessed with tech yeah see and it's not bad not bad now subah uth ke yahi karna padega humko mom please ha <laughs> what to call oh my god that's cool you ask for these things boss jenny means jens kitchen i know right whole food i cook so much no i need all the ingredients for me kitchen you know everything should be full a fridge and cabinets everything with food item you know when a previous house malvi south the supermarket guys know ha mummy aa gayi <laughs> because i order so many stuff from the supermarket thank you thank you yeah thank you so much thank you and to wash the vegetable it takes one hour i wash all the vegetables like kadi patta se leke tomato ginger and i break coconut and keep inside and keep the shell also to give dam some time na with the ghee and the grapes so it stays clean you know so many people touch this fruits and vegetables better to be safe so i always wash and keep even the cans when they get from the supermarket i wash all the cans even those idea aata everything and wash and keep so it takes one hour to wash only i'm soaking rajma for tomorrow i already uploaded the recipe for this anyway check my description box for the recipe uh, see i got this from the zepto and some of the bananas are not good that's why i go personally <laughs> i make a smoothie for malvika banana grapes blueberry and honey and almond milk delicious look at this i put ice also while uh, blending no see nice and thick uh, and i made uh, i make a mango also same way look at this so yum give salad this is a baby cucumber looks like tenly you know and uh, with the tomato This is so delicious. This is so nice and crunchy. 
to show you how to make moong dal i call this yellow dal wash uh, several times and add fresh water enough water and soak for it for 10 to 20 minutes then add to this to the pressure cooker and add salt turmeric and uh, asafoetida and fenugreek seed powder and pressure cook this for two or three whistles Once they're done, open the lid. Allow the pressure to reduce and open the lid. And mash it a bit. Like this. We want little grain also. We don't complete mashed dal. Like this. Now let's keep tadka. Here I have chopped tomatoes. Or chopped coriander. Garlic. Green chilli. And dry chilies. And cumin. Heat oil in a kadai small kadai and add uh, garlic and stir fry them until they're nice and golden and fragrant when you get that garlicky smell go ahead and add green chilies and dry red chilies and give it a stir now add tomatoes stir and cook until they're nice and soft and add cumin seed and add a little red chili powder and pour this tadka over the cooked bath. Mm. Looks so good. Yum, delicious. Look at this. So simple to make and so delicious. Add one small cube of uh, butter. And with white rice, pickle, papar, good to go. <laughs> and with omelette also, it is so good. I made omelette today. This is, I made little thick dal. You can add little water also, but we like little thick. This combination goes well, like kachumbar salad with the masala omelette. Perfect. So comforting. I have noticed I start eating a lot of rice. I should cut down on rice now. <laughs> I always like a lot of vegetables, salad and all that. Anyway, I hope you like this recipe. You can become an interior decorator, you know. I really designer, can. Designer. Wait till you see the house. Oh You're my gonna God. faint. <laughs> the owner's gonna wanna. She's gonna help me. With this, she's gonna show me where to put what. The kitchen, yeah. all the bottles and everything. I am my mom's own Marie Kondo. Mm hmm. <laughs> Marie Kondo is a person. Ah, not then dictionary. <laughs> dictionary me don't tell. What does mean? My mom doesn't know Marie Kondo. Okay. But I'm gonna Marie Kondo her entire simple, house. Simple word. Organized. Ah. So, Marie Kondo, they know Marie Kondo. Okay. Everybody knows Marie Kondo. I don't know. <laughs> people who organize like crazy people know her. She's very perfect in her organization. Okay. So I picked up all of that and now I'm organizing my entire cabinet. Then I'll show you. No ah. cardboard to be seen. My mom is like, oh my god. I was like, label every single bottle and jar. Yes, ma'am. So, <laughs> selecting which bottle to order for the spices and lentils and for the other stuffs still but not finished uh, doing the studios my god so many stuff more than my kitchen item <laughs> I made uh, pasta for me Malvik and Veronica they couldn't stop raising <laughs> that's all for now good night if you enjoy watching this vlog don't forget to hit that subscribe button and uh, this is for my next vlog i might do part two uh let's see how it goes okay ciao for now it's a local market here anyway don't forget to like share subscribe to my channel ciao for now